Hey folks, what's Welcome back another Pawn Masters video, and, uh, uh, sorry, this one's late, I legit, I, I, I thought Adam it was tomorrow. <laughs> I thought Adam it was tomorrow, so anyways. Uh, yeah, yeah, today let's, uh, let's check out, uh, a special costume Adam and, and Ursaloon over here. Uh, on the bright side, we do have a lot more info about this unit, now that it's released, because there was a lot of stuff that we didn't really know about how this unit was going to work, especially, you know, some of the multipliers and stuff, but now it's actually out, and folks have tested it, and it's updated, and Pomad Tools, we do have a much, much better idea of, um, how some of the mechanics work on this unit, because this is a, it is a pretty, um, it's a pretty unique unit, right? Got a lot of new, um, stuff in here, so let's, uh, let's, let's go over it, uh, real quick. So this one is a striker, right, with, a. Support EX, uh, EX moves, or EX move, uh, EX roll. So yeah, let's, uh, again, some of the, uh, upsides. Uh, first of all, for a striker, it is a two-gauge damage dealer, right? It's just, you know, it's only a two-gauge damage dealer. Um, and it's a two-gauge move that does some pretty good damage, right? 240 base power, 5-5, five five with, uh, with the B move over there, right? And, um, the activation condition is pretty easy to two. Um, as long as the user's burned, it's just active. Right, uh, so, you know, as long as you don't have, like, uh, you know, Misty Starmie or, or Confi on the team and then you accidentally cure your burn or whatever. <laughs> so, if you are running him, you know, just make sure you don't accidentally run, um, some support that has healing hand on your team, right, that ac accidentally heals his burn. Uh, but yeah, I mean, getting burned is really easy because his trainer move just does that instantly, right? This is a really, really good trainer move. Um, straight up plus six attack, plus three crit, and then gets the burn on. One click, you're done set up completely, right? Uh, you also have facade as well, so there's something, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> um, so, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, outside of that, it has a really, really strong um, striker AoE sync, right? I mean, um... It might not seem like he's like a, um, you know, that that great because like if you if you look, if you look at the stats for example like under three hundred attack that's not good like at all <laughs> right that's 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 not great but he does have some nice uh, multipliers here and there right he has um, haymaker over here he has wounded sync up nine right I believe there's also was it in his passive. Da -da 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 -da. Yeah, 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 another one, status condition, sync move up nine, right? So that's like a lot of, like, sync stuff, um, uh, or, or, or sync stuff, multipliers, sync multipliers, <laughs> uh, even though he does have pretty low physical, uh, attack over there, so you do have that at least, right? At least, um, if we go over to, to runner stock, he's like, like, you know, by far, <laughs> um, the, the strongest, uh, the striker, uh, or ground type striker AOE sync user that's not Roxanne who needs an EX roll for it, right? So that's uh again that's really 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 good. Like that's yeah that's 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 like a that's like a million more than like the next highest one, which is um ver what uh, variety well variety Giovanni's in, uh the, the field right um Cynthia right whatever they're about the same. So that's that's pretty huge. Um, I mean, his regular damage isn't, like, bad or whatever, but it's, um, it's nothing, it's, it's, it's nothing, it's nothing crazy. Uh, I'm not sure if, uh, Runner has updated this with the uh, newest info on, on his multipliers, but, um, regardless, I mean, it's still pretty good. It's still pretty good, but, um, again, uh, it's, it's, uh, yeah. I mean, there's, there's just some things you have to you have to get first before like you know you get like the full of his multiplier and look maybe you don't want to get his full multiplier because that requires ha ha having your hp lowered right if you check out uh, again the the b move smaller users percentage of remaining hp the greater power of this attack so yeah i mean you could get there uh, obviously with the opponent hitting you know aoe moves or if you want to like ex support roll him i guess you could maybe put hit him up front but it's 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 still pretty tough, I'd say. Right? He has good HP, but um, but the I'd say the more more reliable way is just from the burn damage, right? So there's that. Um, so, yes, it, it's just yeah. Sometimes sometimes like I'd I'd rather play it safer and not get the full multiplier there than um go in there and just have my HP just get reduced to like under thirty percent or whatever just to get the full multiplier. Um, so. 
I believe the multiplier uh, works like this, right? Um, if I could find, uh, yep, there it is, right? So at 100%, it's 0% BP increase. If it's under 100% but higher or equal to 75%, it's 10% BP increase. Uh, is under 75% um, and higher to equal to 50% uh, is 20% BP increase. And then if it's under 50% um, uh, higher or equal to 25 percent is 30 percent bp increase if it's under 25 percent it's a 50 percent bp increase obviously the big jump over here is from 25 right um or or uh, uh, uh from uh under 50 percent to under 25 percent that's like a extra 20 percent bp increase all the other ones are like in intervals of like 10 percent uh bp increase but again it's it's it's, it's kind of risky right i mean you know if you do that and the opponent sinks and then or, or you get hit by a stray AOE move, uh, that, 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 could, that could be tough, that could be tough, right? You do have at least endurance in the grid, so that will, I mean, there are a decent amount of things in the grid that will help, but um, again, I just, overall, it's not that much, right? Except for, again, for that last um, step, which is a big uh, increase, but yeah, you got, you, you got stuff, right? There's lesser burn nine if you want that. You have um, endurance over here. Right, St stuff like that. There's that healing one as well, right? Uh, yeah, yeah. If you're um, uh, burned in, in a pinch, you heal your entire HP back. But again, if you heal your entire HP back, then you lose out all, on all the multipliers there as well. So, um, yeah. But uh, there's there's stuff danger damage guard, right? You have potions, which you could use for yourself or teammates, whatever. Um, there's 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 ways there's ways. <laughs> but uh, yeah, that's that I guess. Um, but um, outside of that, you also do have this burn hit physical boost that gives you a physical move up next. Plus one, right? Every time uh, after you use a uh, attack after, uh, when you're burned. So there's stuff like that. There's uh, there's gritty, which is just through straight up 30%, right? So he does have some multipliers over there that could help um, with his damage. So yeah, I mean, his, his damage is not bad. It's, it's not bad uh, at all. So... Uh, outside of that, um, I think yeah, yeah, that yeah, that's that's most of the uh, upsides. Let's talk about some of the downsides. Um, again, we talked about this already, right? The HP based multipliers is, is kind of tough, right? And uh, makes it kind of risky, and it is slow. Uh, it's not like it's not bad though, right? It, I just say like slow in terms of like the base speed is low, so like you know. The contribution on that front of the overall team but like himself like he's not like a bad gauge unit at all right he's, just, he's not a bad gauge unit again he's just a two gauge striker that has this right which gives you like two gauges back when you're like attacking with all your burn so that's it's i'm, I'm not saying like he's like a negative gauge in fact he's probably probably a net positive <laughs> gauge contrib uh, a contribution just you know in terms of if you have like team speed buff it's not gonna so the base speed slow it's not gonna be like that much but um so yeah that's that's not like a really bad thing i guess um maybe maybe like one other little thing is uh as like a ground type unit he is one of those rare ground units that don't really run in sand right which uh you know that's 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 something to take note i guess right because uh, a, a lot of ground units do do run with sand and he doesn't so yeah i mean i guess you could still run him in sand just to get that extra little bit of chip damage in for his hp to decrease whatever or or, or even sun with like grout on or but yeah he, he doesn't have any like big like weather stuff there all right now let's talk a bit about the synchroid lucky skill and team cup all that stuff so um lucky skill wise he you know he, he does have one of those um lucky skills like exclusive unique uh, character lucky skills um that you could get for free from the event it's like entry physical boost one, which gives you like plus one physical move up next on entry, like the first time, which is, uh, I, I wouldn't really go for that. <laughs> I mean, yeah, yeah, I, I really wouldn't. I, I don't think that's, I don't think that's really good in comparison to Crit Strike 2. I think Crit Strike 2 is just straight up better, right? Cause that's only like one extra additive, like 40% boost for one hit. And because of the fact that he sets up so fast, like, Turn one, your trainer move. Turn two, you're just straight up just gonna um, start attacking, right? Like you're not even like getting an extra sync boost off of that like physical move up next over there. And plus, again, if you do have him three out of five, he gets plenty like physical move up next, anyways. 
So, um, yeah, crit strike 2, even though it's 20%, it's 20% for every single hit, including your sync as well, so that's, I think crit strike 2 is straight up better over there. Um, other than that, I guess you could do gritty if you want. Um, again, gritty doesn't really apply to sync, and one of his big things is a sync, so I still feel like crit strike 2 is better <laughs> uh, than most lucky skills uh, on him. Obviously, you could do super power if you want, but, um... Uh, nowadays, like, I feel like with, um, high score event being a thing, I mean, mm, yeah, 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 like, mm, most time I feel like, uh, in, in a lot of scenarios, uh, superpower isn't as, as great, but, uh, you know, yeah. <laughs> uh, you could get Lesser Burn 9 in there if you don't want to pick up Lesser Burn, Lesser Burn 9 in the grid. Um, you get the gradual, I don't even know, because, uh, you could do gradual healing if you're really worried about the HP thing, but I get if you do gradual healing, then that just kind of mitigates the damage from the burn, which you can't really get your, like, HP down that much, so... Yeah, yeah. Again, in general, I feel like Chris Strike 2, even though, you know, you think there's, oh, there's like, a lot of um, possibilities with this unit, but in the end, I feel like Chris Strike 2 is still probably better <laughs> in most case scenarios. So, alright. Let's talk about the Sync Red. Right, uh, let's start at 2 out of 5 over here, uh, and now I'll probably just add, like, the extra whatever points we could get in there, um, if, if, if we just need, like, a bit more, I need to pick up something, so. Uh, okay, so, over here, uh, there's a f few things of, of note, I guess. First of all is the potion stuff, right? I mean, potions are nice, <laughs> right? Uh, even if it's, you know, for your teammates, um, the initial pinch physical boost three that's pretty solid right uh these two i can or these three uh i feel like endurance you probably want to go pick it up these two it really depends it really depends i mean because again sometimes in a, like a shorter stage right uh, longer stage i'd probably still play it safe but it's for sure so you probably want the damage there anyways plus you have endurance over there so you, you don't have to worry that much right and then lesson burn first of all it's very far away um but also i mean you can still afford it but again lesson burn it's harder for you to get taken down by the burn but also it just makes your hp reduction slower which means your damage boost. Again, it, it, it's it's just it's a balancing act, right? Um, it really just depends on, uh, you know, how long the stage is to fight, and um, like how many AOE <laughs> the opponent does. Like if they if the opponent is more like AOE based, right? Uh, I I probably play it safer and pick up some of those um you know lesser burn nine the the HP recovery stuff. If if they're not and if it's just a really fast battle, it's just just, just let the burn eat your HP down and just, just go wild on them. All right, I'd say that's probably, it's probably would be would be my approach. Three out of five is where you get the big sync stuff, and again, his sync is pretty powerful, right? His sync is is, is I feel like um of all things probably like the biggest uh, uh spotlight for 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 this guy. So, um, let's see where are the one, two. I think I'm still missing. Am I missing one? No, 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 no. The other one's on the on the passive. So yeah, that that's. That's all the sync stuff, right? Um, again, depends if you want to go, go pick this up. But you know, it, it, could, it could, it could, it links these two, I guess. So, like, there's that. You could go for this. Just go for like a full on just sync thing, right? Like a, if you're fighting like a quick master mode stage or whatever, you could, you could, you could definitely do something like this. Um, you could do, you could do a bit of a mixture as well right because you know again gritty three is over here right it costs 10 but i mean it's gritty three which is pretty solid right it's just straight up 30 percent more um which i mean that's like three stages of your health decrease equivalent so like i'd, I'd take that uh, i'd still think endurance is um pretty uh it's 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 just a nice insurance to have right so um maybe if you if you don't need that you could you go over here, right? Save yourself some 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 energy where you could spend elsewhere if you or you could still have this and just spend that extra whatever sync orb for the extra bit of energy. But um, but yeah, you could if you have enough, 
You could also pick up this attack plus 30. Right. Um, otherwise, the other big one is down here. That's the annoying part though, because like the gauge stuff and, um, and, and the physical boost is like, they're all down here. Right. So like, it's, it's, it's just a tough reach. It's just a really tough reach. So if you do want to go for a more like a DPS focused rather than sync, which I don't really think you should, unless you just really have like a better sync or like a EX rolled like fall rock sand, just cause again, like his main feature is more so his sync, right? But um, yeah, I mean, t down this path is just really nice. Just cause you get that extra, the move gauge back. Right, because again, he is relatively slow, even though he's just two gauge move user. But the move gauge pack is just so nice, man. It's so nice. I love it. Anyways, um, pinch push three could be pretty good too in um, in specific scenarios, right? Because that's just straight up. That's straight up. That's straight up a, a round off of your sing move countdown, right over there. Um, but that really depends on you know how fast can you get to that, right? Versus the stages. Um, but yeah, uh, you could definitely do like a like a bit of a both sort of thing, right? You could at least get that wounded sync up. You still get gritty endurance, and then still pick up these two down here. So you know, there's there's the there's things you could do with the with the grid, right? Again, depends on on the playstyle. All right, so now in terms of team comps, you could probably run something like this, right? You have um, corny camera up there to, to AOE debuff opponents. Um, physical defense, right? That helps. Obviously, ground zone, all that stuff. Um, this team, uh, Corny, I mean, biggest issue with Corny, obviously, is speed, right? So, in this case, probably want to pick up the, um, the the move gauge back, right? Because you you want gauges, right? So, so there is that. You could you could run that, and again, support always, just any of these, like, big physical sports, top Bulu, whatever, right? It's still um, one of the best. Um, you could also run this one. The, the the field right on um giovanni uh this one's uh, this one he's he's good right i mean obviously like damage wise uh, he's, he's better than 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 courtney right um but he does have like first of all he does have like the sand thing which is fine right i mean it could help some chip damage um but it's more so like they kind of compete a bit for sync because again the big thing about him is his big AOE sync and then on Giovanni's end it's like he's, he's a field unit you, you want to sync to get the uh, ground zone over here with him so that's uh that's 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 a bit of an issue I feel like um but you know he's just a good overall unit so that's you could, it's still a good justification I guess um as for anything else you could have this um the the, the original Cynthia obviously she's just just good in general, right? Um, decent speed, all that stuff. Uh, yeah, she's, yeah, she's Cynthia, man. Especially if you do have her five out of five. Um, Maxi, you could have that extra um, physical master passive boost over there again. With this one, it's gonna be like gauge thing, right? So, you know, certain units you just wanna pr probably um, prioritize more of the, the move gauge stuff. Oh yeah, I guess you could also have Fanfi as like the support um, if you don't have, like, uh, the top Bulu, um, I'm, I'm still not a huge fan of this unit, right, because it, it does give you ground rebuff, but, like, outside of that, it's really kind of whatever, <laughs> but, um, yeah, just, just, like, for your support, right, it, just pick based on whatever your other unit needs, because he's just, you know, one click, you got everything maxed out right or if it's like someone who also could do that then just you know maybe someone who just picks support that debuffs the opponent's physical defense gives um super effective up next physical move up next gauges right stuff like that even like tanks right good tanks all that uh what else this guy wait did we talk about him i don't think so but he's good right doesn't really bring anything special to the uh table other than he's does good damage, which is which is good, right? Which is good. Uh, the gauges might uh, be a bit of an issue here as well, so that's uh, that's another consideration as well. Um, Roxanne, I probably wouldn't, just because you know uh, they they compete for sync, right? 
because um, you know obviously in this case uh, assuming she's the X roll you're you're gonna sync with Roxanne instead of then for him he's just like DPS which again he's a solid DPS but there's probably just better safer options maybe <laughs> right but uh, you know you can still run him if you want so okay so um overall I mean personally uh, it is definitely a different unit right um, you know definitely applaud them for for trying some new stuff up here especially with the the self burn all that stuff right that the guts sort of not not guts but uh the, the the gritty sort of thing right um i don't know personally i'm not a huge fan um yeah just because like the like the 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 like the decrease like i don't mind the oh the lesser hp you have the, the more you deal but like I feel like it's kind of, the reward isn't like, the rest of the reward, I don't feel like it's that great overall. Um, the Again, the big, big, big thing about this unit is still that it has a really, really, really powerful striker AoE sync, right? But on the other hand, like, you know, fall, fall Roxanne if you EX roll her. It does cost you an EX roll, okay, you know, can't, uh, but, uh, but still. Um, obviously, uh, he definitely does more DPS than Fall Roxanne, but uh, yeah, um, he's he's just a really really nice overall like hybrid sort of damage dealer, right? Uh, in the department of dealing damage, he's a uh, pretty well rounded, right? Pretty well rounded damage dealer. Um, easy to set up. So yeah, like the downsides really aren't that bad. So maybe it's like a personal preference thing, but I don't know, like also considering like all the other banners that are up at the moment, like, and, and you know, some other ones that, that are coming up, I don't feel like he's that big of a priority. Um, like obviously if you're a big Adamant fan or a Saluna fan, just go for it, right? I mean, he's good, definitely a good enough unit. Um, but I don't know, maybe, maybe a, maybe a 8.1 out of 10, <laughs> perhaps. Right, but um, yeah, I mean, again, if you're looking for a ground type damage dealer, he he's definitely he's definitely him, right? He's definitely fantastic in in, in that uh, in that regard, right? Um, is he probably the best rock type, or uh, rock type ground type damage dealer at the moment? Maybe, yeah, probably, right? I I'd say so probably, but again, it's just not a huge fan of of some of the mechanics here, but uh, <laughs> overall. Maybe it's just a personal preference thing, but uh, the numbers are there for sure. So at least that's good, right? That's you know you can, you can never knock a knock a damage dealer for uh, for doing damage at least. So yeah. Anyways, that's me. This one, I guess. Hope you all join them, guys. Think in the comments down below. Uh, like enjoy the videos for comments for some more poem as Kana. We'll uh, we'll go live, try to pull for this guy, and we'll actually try them out later. Um, so stay tuned for that, and I'll see you guys in the next one.